Hey guys, Infinity from Static Feeds here, playing some Battlefield 3 Team Deathmatch on Tehran Highway. Kinda got a uh, sick of Conquest, because my team was ass as fuck every time, and especially on Metro, when I was playing on Metro, we used to capture the two flags, and then we just, they would just fucking dominate us, and take all three flags, and my team would just be in, in their spawn. Like getting raped, and I was just tired of that shit. Just fucking tired. So I decided to play Team Deathmatch. This is what I used to play on my Xbox. This is that this PC gameplay, but yeah. All right, so here today I'm gonna tell you guys why you should be playing multiplayer games on low settings. This game is actually uh, what I'm. This gameplay is. 1080p on low settings and the game looks damn good still still looks damn good nowhere near the console like what the console looks like console battlefield 3 at least the xbox with hd uh the hd downloaded graphics so you have to do that for xbox because it won't fit on the disc but uh anyways the reason why you, should, you guys should be playing is because whenever you move your mouse around all right, well, first let me tell you my frames per second while playing this. My average is about 100 frames per second while playing on low settings, 1080p. And while I'm recording, while I'm recording, it's about 100 frames per second. While I'm not, it's probably like 110, 115. And when I recorded with uh, high settings, everything the highest maxed out, it was about 60 to 70 while recording. So, yeah, that's a big increase, 100 frames like 30 or 40 frames per second increase while playing on low settings and what this does it makes all of your mouse movements really really smooth and it gives you an advantage overall to the player who's playing at 30 frames per second 45 frames per second 60 frames per second and so on until they get to more frames per second than you have like me i have i definitely have an advantage over a person with 60 frames per second it just makes the game so much smoother Whenever you're moving your mouse, your mouse, your mouse, your mouse around and trying to aim down on someone. Sorry, I'm a little bit, I'm a little cold today. I don't know why, but where I'm at right now, it's like I just there's like a cold, uh, cold front or something. I don't know. It was like that two weeks ago. It was like 100 degrees, and I was like 65 this morning. So I don't know what the fuck is going on. But fucking Canada, man, fuck them. Hey Canada. Sorry guys, if you're from Canada, but it's the truth. Thank you guys. Just kidding. Subscribe to me. <laughs> uh but what was I talking about? Oh yeah. It makes everything much smoother. Trust me guys, I did this. This improved uh, my performance a little bit. You can't really tell by this video because I haven't been I'm not really that good at Battlefield 3 right now. I used to be fucking beast. But yeah. Hopefully when Battlefield 4 comes out. You know, I want to try hard uh, because I really like competition and I used to play Call of Duty like kind of competitively and I, I'm really good, but I switched over to Battlefield 3 because Call of Duty is just the same shit like I said before, and, but yeah, I really, I really love Battlefield and I'm definitely going to be doing Battlefield 4 commentaries in the future guys, so uh, stay tuned to that. Well, whenever it comes out, I, I don't even remember when it comes out, but hopefully I'll get the limited edition if I have enough money, because spending money, you gotta buy clothes and shoes for school and all this shit, and I bought a lot of Steam games that I could have instead bought the Battlefield 3 limit, I mean Battlefield 4 limited edition, so yeah, I probably should have not bought all those games, but yeah, say you're, you say you're uh, for FPS to minimum settings, because you guys will definitely have an advantage over other players. So, thanks for watching me, guys. Peace.